At the Paris Air Show on June 16, 2025, Sweden confirmed a sweeping plan to enhance its Saab JAS-39 Gripen fighter fleet with cutting-edge electronic warfare EW, systems. According to Colonel Frederick Suskind, head of the Gripen modernization effort, this upgrade is being fast-tracked due to growing security concerns across Europe and NATO's renewed focus on electronic spectrum dominance. The EW initiative will run alongside the ongoing deployment of the advanced Gripen E model, with initial aircraft scheduled to arrive this year. Saab's commitment to EW development reflects its broader push to evolve the Gripen platform under its ambitious project Beyond Initiative, which leverages artificial intelligence and advanced networking. With battlefield dynamics changing rapidly, especially given lessons drawn from the war in Ukraine, European nations are being urged to develop stronger autonomous EW capabilities rather than relying solely on US support. Sweden is responding by coordinating closely with its National Defense Procurement Body, FMV, to explore options for upgrading some of the 60 incoming Gripen E fighters or possibly acquiring new ones pre-equipped with high-end EW systems. Saab's future vision for the Gripen is already in motion. Between May 28 and June 3, 2025, Saab and German AI firm Helsing ran a series of groundbreaking test flights where Gripen E operated autonomously using the Centaur AI system. Conducted in civilian Swedish airspace, these trials marked the first known real-world application of AI for beyond visual range BVR, combat involving an operational fighter. Centaur AI successfully performed advanced flight maneuvers, made real-time targeting decisions, and engaged in tactical scenarios against a human-piloted Gripen D. Thanks to its modular, software-defined avionics, the Gripen E was able to integrate the AI system directly into its core flight systems without interfering with critical safety functions. Saab described this as a major leap forward in air combat philosophy, where new capabilities can be introduced rapidly via software updates rather than waiting on traditional hardware upgrades. The combination of AI agility, advanced EW, and operational flexibility sets the Gripen E apart from other NATO aircraft. The Gripen program's evolution is being carried out in distinct phases, combining upgrades to the existing C-D versions with a shift to the next-gen E-F variants. Current C-D jets are receiving the MS-20 Block 3 package and are being readied for Block 4, which includes the enhanced PS-05-AMK-4 radar, Taurus KEPD-350 cruise missiles, and state-of-the-art electronic warfare enhancements. This phased approach ensures continued combat effectiveness into the 2030s while positioning the Gripen E-F fleet as NATO-ready multi-role fighters optimized for evolving mission demands. Sweden's broader military transformation is rooted in a 2019 government mandate to build a more robust national defense. Brigadier General Lars Helmrich from FMV revealed that since 2021, defense procurement has surged by 350%, with a 50% increase in agency staffing. This has enabled Sweden to overhaul its entire aerial arsenal, from trainer jets to critical intelligence platforms such as the Global Eye Early Warning Aircraft, now being delivered ahead of schedule. Helmrich also underscored the growing relevance of technologies like hypersonic weapons, stealth platforms, and AI, noting that while Sweden may not pursue all avenues independently, NATO must be prepared to both deploy and defend against such threats. Major General Jonas Wickman, who leads the Swedish Air Force, described a major doctrinal shift in how Sweden trains and operates since joining NATO. Once focused on national self-defense and tactics like operating from concealed forest runways, the Swedish Air Force now aims to both contribute its unique expertise and absorb knowledge from alliance partners. Wickman stressed that Sweden's integration into NATO will be backed by robust investments in technological advancement and combat readiness. By blending advanced electronic warfare systems with real-time AI combat capability, Sweden is reshaping the Gripen E into a formidable asset for NATO. Saab's tech-forward roadmap, paired with FMV's strategic procurement efforts, signals a clear intent, Sweden is not just adapting to a new defense reality, it's aiming to shape it.